let us think of three problems like you know in auto transformer now okay basically in some of the publications they have given dot here okay but in the original question dot is here only you please cross check okay you are like you know old gate publications okay in this 50 kva 3300 by 230 volts single phase transformer is connected as an auto transfer as shown in given figure the nominal rating of the transformer will be what is the nominal rating see here aiding or opposing aiding aiding okay so aiding in the sense how much will be the output voltage 3300 multiplied by 230 so 3300 multiplied by 230 sorry plus 230 additive voltage okay plus 230 is going to be the total voltage multiplied by how much is the current how much is the current see here here 3300 is given okay so here 3300 is given means that it is 230 volts okay so from here to here is 3300 means that remaining portion separate winding is going to be 230 so this is 50 kva by 230 is going to be the current so 50 kva by 230 is going to be the current if you calculate this it will come to 767.4 kva so answer will be this okay now let us see this problem actually this is very good problem really very good problem because means like you know actually data is written drawn here written here the figure shows coil 1 and 2 coil 1 and coil 2 with dot markings as shown in given figure having 4000 turns in the sense 4000 turns are here this is going to be 4000 turns and 6000 turns respectively 6000 turns respectively both the coils have rated current of 25 you have to keep it in mind both the coils are having 25 amperes okay so lv winding area of cross section is also designed for 25 and he winding area of cross section also designed for 25 amperes only coil one is excited with single phase 400 volts 58 supply okay now come back to here the coils are to be connected to obtain a single phase 400 by 1000 volts 400 by 1000 volts so means if i try to draw the connection diagram because they are asking the connection diagram here okay so it should be additive or subtractive additive because output voltage is 1000 volts so 400 if i 4, 400 if i supply across coil 1 600 will be the second one <coughs> so it should be additive Additive in the sense dot here, dot here, okay. And 400 volts is the input. So if it is 400 volts, okay, it will be 600 volts. Such that output voltage is going to be 1000 volts. Okay. Now let us see how to connect this. Yes, but the connection diagram for 400 they have given A here, they have given B here, and for the second one, undotted one is going to be D dotted one is going to be c dotted one is going to be c now in order to form this like you know we have to connect a and d and b should be the common terminal okay so we have to connect a and d common should be b okay so connection diagram over okay now let us think of the third one okay in this in the auto transformer obtained in 61 in the previous question the current in each coil is okay so in this what is the kva capacity they have given 10000 okay so 10000 va 10 kva in the sense he is going to connect some load here okay so this is going to absorb 10 kva means that this is going to be 1000 volts so how much current will flow 10 amperes okay so if current is 10 amperes here see here current is coming out of the dot 10 ampere okay so current should go into the dot how much will be this current actually this is hv this is lv because 600 volts is hv 400 volts is going to be lv so hv current to lv current it should be increased or decreased it should be increased because from hv to lv voltage has to be reduced and current has to be increased so that current this particular current is going to be increased means that 600 by 400 is going to be increment which will give you 15 amperes okay so here this is going to be 15 amperes okay and hv set uh, 10 amperes is equivalent to lv set 15 amperes so selected now this is going to be coil 1 and this is going to be coil 2 so coil 1 is having 15 amperes 
coil 2 is going to have coil 2 is going to have 10 amperes that's it 